You hate to see things like that happen to elderly people. A 71 year old woman carjacked in broad daylight, a brazen crime that was caught on camera. The woman was dropping off her car to a West Hartford auto repair shop. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Zeller is joining us live from West Hartford Police Department with more on exactly what happened here. Courtney. Well, that woman was dropping her car off for repairs. Her husband was going to meet her at this auto repair shop in another car, uh, but instead she had a gun pointed at her and her car stolen. On a Sunday morning at 11 o'clock, who would ever think something like that would happen? Businesses on Cody Street in West Hartford are on high alert after surveillance shows the moments leading up to a carjacking. In the video, you see a Honda Accord pull up and park on the side of the curb. The driver, a 71-year-old woman, was dropping her car off at an auto repair shop. The business is off to the right. One minute later, on the left side of your screen, you'll see a man dressed in black walk behind the Honda. He walks to the auto repair shop and tries to open the doors, but they are locked. Seconds later, you see the same man walk back towards the Honda. You see him take out a gun from his left pocket. He walks to the driver's side door. The woman is sitting inside. I was actually kind of shocked. Um, we haven't had anything to that level before of that type of crime. The video also shows the suspect open the driver's side door. After a few seconds, the woman gets out. She walks towards the back of the car, and the suspect speeds off. If she was 20 minutes earlier or a half hour later, it never would have happened, and it just happened to be the wrong place at the wrong time, and the way the stars aligned, if you want to call it, it's very unfortunate for the woman. She must have been scared out of her mind. For companies in the area, they tell us they've seen crime happening more and more. They are taking precautions themselves. We have increased our security ca cameras and lights and everything because of that. Uh, it just seems over the years that uh, it, it, things have started going downhill and probably more so in the last two or three years, probably since COVID hit. And we just learned police found the woman's car, but it sounds like they haven't found the suspect yet. If you have any information, you're asked to call West Hartford Police. We're live from West Hartford tonight. Courtney Zeller, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.